Hi, in this video I'm going to show you how you can use a free Facebook proxy. Um, in fact, it's actually a sophisticated security program called Identity Cloaker, which will allow people to access Facebook if they're blocked. Um, now, Facebook is periodically blocked in many countries across the world. Um, in December 2013, which is now when I'm making this video, um, it's not too bad. I think uh, China, who have always blocked it, North Korea, who block everything, um, Syria, Iran, and maybe a couple of others are blocking Facebook. But um, over the years, quite a lot of countries have blocked it. Um, I was in Turkey several years ago, and there was some... It was blocked there for a few weeks. Um, it's been blocked in places like Bangladesh, Pakistan, um, over various scandals, the Prophet Muhammad cartoon thing. Um, Facebook got banned there, um, along with YouTube and some other programs. Um, but uh, it does get blocked a lot. It also gets blocked in schools and um, companies uh, mainly because people can spend a lot of time on Facebook. Um, if you use this method to bypass those sort of restrictions in companies or company firewalls and stuff, um, bear in mind um, they're blocked for a reason and you might get yourself into trouble if you do, but this will generally work. Okay, well what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you the program that will allow you to um, access Facebook when it's normally blocked. Um, as I said, the program is called Identity Cloaker. Um, it's a paid security program normally, but there is a demo mode. Um, the link in the description will take you to the demo mode, um, which is completely free. Now it works, it's sort of fully functional. Um, you access it from this installation, um, but it is, it, its only restriction is it will only allow you to access certain sites. But one of those sites is Facebook. Okay, there's a little list here um, of the sites you can access when this connection is up. Um, remember, you'll have to disconnect this to go back to your normal browsing, but it only takes a minute. Uh, you basically go to that link below, install Identity Cloaker, um, the username and demo is demo and the password is demo too, and just run it. It sits in your taskbar and I'll load it up now to show you. And here it is. Um, I've got the full version, but the demo version looks exactly the same and works the same way as well. Basically, we've got a list of servers here, and if you they're in places all over the world. Um, and if you double click on one, you can create a secure connection to it. Uh, it's completely secure. It's encrypted. Nobody can see your IP address or anything like that. <coughs> Um, and I use it for uh, security when I'm traveling as well. I also use it to access things like BBC iPlayer um, using a British server if I want a British IP address or Hulu, Pandora in the States and a few stuff in Ireland and um, Australia. Uh, the demo mode won't do that, but it will work with um, um, Facebook. Okay, so you basically just pick a server. Uh, I would generally look down the response times there and pick the fastest one, which will generally be nearest you. It doesn't really matter the location. Um, so you pick it there, double click, and you will create an active connection. Um, and that's basically it, really. Um, if you're previously blocked accessing Facebook, this should bypass that block. Um, there are advanced settings. Um, in some corporate networks, there are tighter restrictions. Um, one of them being that there will be a firewall rule that blocks access to the outside world only through one um, specific IP address, i.e. their proxy server. Um, Identity Cloaker can get around that. There's a, if you look in the advanced settings, there's um, uh, a local proxy mode which will allow you to piggyback that. Um, I'm not going to go into details here. Um, if you can understand my little description, I'm sure you can make it work there. You need to get the proxy uh, user username to go through the connection. Normally it works pretty great. Um, it'll get past most restrictions. It'll get past content filters um, like WebSense and stuff which actually look inside the packet because Identity Cloaker encrypts everything so they can't see where you're accessing and what you, what site you're visiting, okay? Um, and that's pretty much it. It's um, a brilliant little program. Um, it's simple to use and the demo mode um, works flawlessly and there are no time restrictions on it. So if you just want to access um, Facebook, just stick on the demo mode. It's free and um, 
works brilliantly. Um, and hey, I'll uh, see you on Facebook. Okay, thanks for listening to my video. I hope you enjoyed it. Goodbye.